that uh, we have learned a lot in the past um, three or four years about how patients perceive um, the success of their therapy versus how the physicians perceive it. And I, I would really encourage patients with acromegaly to be um, very open with their doctor because, you know, as a physician, if I see a normal lab result, I'm like, yay, I did it. You know, your IGF-1 is normal. Congratulations, see in three months or six months. And for some of those patients, what we're learning from patient-specific surveys is they don't necessarily feel like that. They're still having headaches or they might have symptoms at the end of their injection period. And um, they're really tolerating a lot of um, symptoms that actually are decreasing their quality of life. And so I would encourage patients to speak up and tell your doctor, okay, my biochemistry may look pretty good here. And you told me my MRI is looking great, but I'm not feeling completely great. And let's sort that out. So we're learning a lot more about um, how the patients feel with acromegaly versus how the physicians think they feel. And it's an important distinction.